Good afternoon. I've always wanted to maintain my independence on this channel. So when companies send me stuff to review, it needs to be something that's either A, cycling related, or B, something that either I would use or I would tell others to avoid. So I'm happy to say that this Prongo Flexco Red Light Therapy module, not only is it cycling related, and I'll tell you why in a moment, but I can thoroughly endorse it because I've already been using it for four weeks with great results. This was actually an easy win for Prongo because I already knew about red light therapy. My knee has been giving me a lot of trouble. I've got uh, osteoarthritis in my knee. In fact, I've got it everywhere, but in my knee it's particularly bad. And I've been advised to get red light therapy as one of the means of pain relief. So I had been taking pain relief daily for my knee and I can report that after four weeks of using this unit, I now don't take painkillers for my knee. So I had already researched quite thoroughly red light therapy because it's used extensively out here in Spain, both by the National Health Service and by physiotherapists to help treat the pain that relates to osteoarthritis. And my osteoarthritis has unfortunately progressed over the last two years, so that it is now actually fairly debilitating, perhaps more relevantly, Red light therapy is also used in the pro peloton for pro athletes to help them recover as it accelerates muscle recovery, reduces inflammation and speeds up the healing of injuries. Many teams use it between stages of the Tour de France because not only is it non-invasive but it's also legal. So though a few of us will require such speedy recovery as riders in the Tour de France, we can still benefit from this if we suffer from injuries such as osteoarthritis rotator cuff injuries of the shoulder, Achilles tendonitis, things which are slow, super slow to recover from. This can both help with the healing process and help with the pain. Or of course it can simply help with muscle soreness after a long day in the saddle. So before we go into the science of this and how it's already been proven to work medically, I can tell you about me. I've been using it for four weeks. I've been using it for 20 minutes a day, maybe with a day or two where I've forgotten to actually put it on, but it's extremely easy and convenient to do. You just sit down, if you're gonna read a book, if you're going to watch TV, if you're going to have a meal, you can simply strap it on and it can be working away for you for 20 minutes and you don't feel a thing. There's a slight warmth to it, but it certainly doesn't burn despite the LED emitters and the lasers, there is no heat to it. It's comfortable and it does provide relief. Now don't expect immediate results. I've deliberately wanted to put off making this video until at least four weeks because I had already read that it can take up to four weeks to start to work. It actually started to work after two to three weeks but the results now are significant. I've stopped taking painkillers before going for a ride. That's a huge thing for me. Even the briefest look online will show just how much information is out there about both red light therapy and also low level laser therapy. If you do go online and have a look, you'll see the most enormous amount of information about both. However, what I'd advise, if you don't altogether believe in it, is to concentrate your research on the medical studies, of which there are dozens. And if you look at the conclusions for each of those randomized, double-blind, peer-reviewed exercises, you'll see that there are positive outcomes for both therapies on every single one. So for me, it's working beautifully. And it's also so convenient because otherwise I would have had to go to the hospital, to the physiotherapy unit to receive my red light therapy there. Instead, it's with me all the time, it's fantastic. So why specifically the Prongo Flexco? Well, I'm not telling you to buy that one. It's the one I've been using and it's worked for me. I like the fact that it's extremely portable, it's extremely easy to use, it's rechargeable. You use it for 20 minutes a day, and it lasts roughly 10 days. So if you charge it once a week, that's all you need to do. It can't really be more convenient. A lot of the uh, red light therapy units you can buy are actually screens. So you sit in front of them and they require you to go to them and that they're plugged in. But also it's the fact that the 
emitters you can place exactly where you need them. They also have specifically the wavelengths which have been proven to be the most effective both in the red light spectrum and also in the near infrared spectrum with the lasers. Between the two they actually penetrate the skin but not just the skin they penetrate muscle and even to the bone so you can actually treat the joint itself. The Prongo comes with a whole series of straps as well so you can use one unit, two units or three units. The straps are of different lengths so you can actually place the units anywhere on your body. It could be, uh, in my case obviously it's the knee, but it could be around your neck, it could be around your waist. Uh, pretty much anywhere where you have pain you can fit these units and treat it. The units actually slot into the carrying case and the carrying case itself has a USB port for charging. So yes, I am a convert. Do I believe it was the only thing that was helping with my uh, knee pain? No. No, I think the extreme temperature that we've been having here as well, it always helps. It's always a little bit better in the summer than it is in the winter. But weeks before starting the treatment, my pain was quite acute. It hasn't gone, by the way. It hasn't gone altogether. It's gone to the point where I don't need to take painkillers every day. And that in itself is enough.